guys, I'm Aaron, and I'm here at Wonder on Paper. It's one of my favorite places. Very, very cool and interesting. Come on, let me show you. So in this little area where you hear some calming music, we can explore the ancient Chinese culture of printing. So back in the day, they didn't have any printers or even paper. So how did they write letters and write these characters? So they would write it on a stone and uh, smooth surfaces, but gradually they were changed into bamboo, but that isn't convenient enough. So they invented paper. And even though already we have paper and that's convenient and all, we don't have printer yet. So if I have a book, all right, if I have a book and you want to read it, I, I have to give it to you and you have to give it back to me. But that's not the most convenient because there's only one book that can only be at one place at one time. That's where printing was invented. And again, it's out of no printer. Let me show you. So here you take a wooden board. Um, you can use Chinese characters or English characters. And over here, it's already filled in with spaces. So you take a little clipper, you clip some out, and you fill it in with uh, some English characters here and Chinese characters. Very intimidating, very cool. So, so after you put it in, put in your set of characters that you want to print, you're going to take a brush and brush on it until it's a... Uh, it's covered in ink, like oil ink. And, and then you're gonna use a clipper here. Take a piece of blank paper, you're gonna clip it, and then press, roll, until you get a beautiful set of characters. And this is my art. So I did it with English characters, and it reads, when all is lost, all is found. Put a lot of bees, yes, I like bees. Uh, I think it's very beautiful, and I'm really glad I came here. Hi everyone, so now I'm interviewing the co-founders of this wonderful place. Hello. Hi, I'm Tim, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. So I have a few questions prepared for you. So. I see this place as a very organized and a uh, little place, but it has a lot of culture and passion behind it. So, uh, how, how long have you wanted to make this place happen? Uh, yeah, we have uh, prepared for, to open this store for two years, but due to the COVID-19, we, ha we didn't open this uh, running this store. Uh, so, uh, it, this store was open on during the May, in the middle of May, so it's only open like uh, three months. Uh, it's a new store, but, uh, uh, this, but uh, this is a, a Chinese culture-based uh, uh, studio, so we just hope everyone have fun here. Are there any times that you do these art, and do you do them often? Well, yeah, uh, because uh, my wife and I, we run this studio together. So uh, usually I, I, I'm the guy that do the introduction and uh, my wife, she always do some uh, handmade uh, craft, right? So that's uh, we have this uh, different job and uh, different duty, uh, yeah? Yeah, that's great. Thanks for your time. Yes, thank you. Thank you for coming and hope you <laughs> enjoy it here. Yeah, had a great time.